Hi everyone, welcome to the CSS program. In today's lesson, we're going to talk about the procedure on how to crimp Ethernet and RJ45. Contents for this lesson are the following, crimp Ethernet wire and RJ45 to establish computer network connection. Understand the differences straight through and crossover type of network cabling. Learn the T568A and T568B pin out of twisted pair wiring. This lesson module will explain crimping U connector, RJ45, to a CAT, E, cable. This can be done with one simple to use tool known as RJ45 crimping tool. It is recommended to use the 3 in 1 tool so that you can strip, cut, and crimp all with the same tool. After cutting the cable to proper length, the first step is to unsheathe the cable. Using the stripper on your crimping tool, Strip the cable back one inch from the end. Insert the cable into the stripper portion of the crimping tool and squeeze it tight. While squeezed, rotate the crimp tool around the cable a full 360 degrees. Pull away and the sheathing will come off. Note, do not cut the twisted pair wires under the outer sheath. This may result in a decrease in or no data transfer. After stripping the wire, the next step is to untwist the smaller wires and arrange them into the proper wiring scheme for the RJ45 connector. The recommended scheme for the wiring is 568B. The scheme is as follows. Once the wire is arranged to the 568B scheme, it needs to be cut down to fit in the connector. This is easily done with the cutting tool on the 3-in-1 crimping tool. Bring the wires tighter together and cut them down, in an even line, to one half inch, from the cut of the sheathing. With the wires cut to proper length for the RJ45 connector, the wires are ready to be inserted into the connector. With the RJ45 connector facing up, securing clip on the underside, insert the wires into the connector. Each wire will fit into each of the eight grooves in the connector. The wires should be inserted until the sheathing is inside the connector, just beyond the crimp portion of the connector. See the image below for proper insertion. Finally, the RJ45 connector needs to be crimped onto the wire. When this happens, the eight pins, at the end of the connector, are pushed down into the wires below. Insert the connector into the crimping portion of the crimping tool until the connector cannot go in any further. Squeeze the crimping tool very tightly and release. Squeeze the crimping tool a second time to make sure that all of the pins are pushed down on the connector. When crimping is complete, remove the wire, now with the connector crimped, from the tool and check the pins to make sure that they are all down. If the pins are all crimped down, Give the connector a slight tug to make sure that it is securely attached to the wire. Then you can check the pin connection by using Network Tester.
Thank you for watching. Have a great day and see you soon.